Hello everyone, this is Harsha. Welcome to my channel Crypto in English. So hi guys, in today's video we are going to talk about Pixel's next part of the video. So in previous video many community members have asked for next part. So in this video I will share how you can make, how you can complete additional two quests, how to buy your first land and which is the best land to do the farming and how to manage your energy bar. So everything will be covered in this video, watch this video till end. Before starting the video, if you are here for the first time, subscribe to the channel. If you like the video, click the like button. If you have any doubts or clarification, leave them in the question below. And uh, this video like that is 200 likes, so definitely click the like button right away. So let's begin the video, guys. So first thing, uh, let's start with the quest, how to start your next two quests. So you will get additional two quests if you are purchasing your first land. So to buy the land, you need to have at least 100 berry tokens. So if you have followed my previous video, you would have only 30 berry tokens. So now what we can do is we will go to the uh, hazel in the marketplace and buy some four berry seeds and we will go and farm those seeds. So just go and talk to hazel. Then uh, buy some four berry seeds. I am buying the seeds. If you already have, you can skip this step. You need 100 berry tokens. I have only 30 tokens. That's why I am doing this. So I purchased some 19 uh, paw berry seeds. So now you can see I have around 25 uh, paw berry seeds in my bag. And now I can go to the land and do the farming. So now uh, to, to go to the land, just click on home button. Now just uh, come down. Uh, left side, you have to go to the uh, this particular building. Just enter this building. And now you will see a red equipment here. So if you click on this red equipment, so whenever you click, it will throw you to a random map. So you, there is no fixed map. So if you see now, I'm if I click on this, I'm getting 3822 land. So again, once I cancel and if I click on again, uh, this equipment, I'll get 4273. So again, if I click 436, uh, then if I click again, it will show a random number. So now what we can do? So every time if you select a random land that might not have a sufficient soil to farm. So that's why I have filtered out and found out one nice land which is having all the features. So that what you can do is you just delete the number and type 4081. So I'll be using this land. I'll tell what is the reason behind this. This particular uh, land is owned by one of the Pixels community member. It is managed well. I'll tell what is the reason behind selecting this map. So now after entering the map, click on wrap now. So once you do that, you'll enter the map location. So first thing is you have to bookmark this land. So anytime you can access this land immediately. So to do that, just click on this welcome board here. You'll get this bookmark page. So just click on bookmark button in the bottom. So once you do that, this mark land will be added to your bookmark. So now whenever you want to access this land, you on the left, left side, you can see the second icon from top. Just click on that. Now you have this bookmarks tab in the computer. Just click on that. Now you can see your 4081 land. Just click on visit. And whenever you click this, you will directly land into this land. So now just go up and do the farming. So this particular uh, land is having around 50 soils. Means you can uh, plant 50 seeds at a time. So I'll just uh, plant some 25 pawberry seeds. And uh, then uh, I'll water them. Watering is mandatory. And after that, I'll harvest them. So here uh, in the um, uh, in the testnet game, there was a different dynamics in the mainnet game. When when you harvest one pawberry uh, crop, you will be getting one pawberry seed and one pawberry fruit. So previously it was a, a, a different thing. So now now we have collected and completed the farming. I got some 30 pawberries and then just click on home button, go to hazel and sell these pawberries to get some berry tokens. So just click on this, uh, talk to hazel. Uh, then go to sell sell tab and go to paw berries and select them and sell them. So for each paw berry, you will be making three berry tokens. So I'll just sell 31, click on sell. Now I got 104 berry tokens. So now why I can uh, buy a land with this 100 tokens. So after buying the land, I'll get additional two quests. So to buy the land, click on home button and just walk to the left, uh, left of this uh, fountain. You will see a plots building. Just enter the plot building. In this, just go to this computer and talk, uh, click on that. So once you click that, it will show you option to buy a plot. So here you have the buy now. Just click on buy now. So down payment is 100 berry tokens. We have that. So just click on confirm. And there you go. You have purchased your first land from Pixels. So now we got the new quest here. So let's start the quest. So to start the quest, you can click on home button or exit this plot building. Just walk to the down. So just come to the center of this fountain. Just walk to the south. Then right side, you can see this post office. So just enter the post office. You will find one lady there. So just go to her and talk to her. Uh, then just click on next, next, next. She will give you three plants, uh, decorative items. So now you have to place them in your land. So just adjust your bag. 
uh, just uh, align them uh, plants onto the top row so that can you can place that so just click on land button click on my land click on visit and once you enter this is your land what you purchase with the 100 berry tokens just plant this uh, uh, click on this plants and land plant them on this soil so now that's all once you've done that you have to go back to post office and talk to that uh, lady so just click on home just come to the bottom enter the post office and talk to her and that completes your first task so after talking to her she'll give you some more decorative items and your task is completed so now again click on her, click on her and again talk to her she will give you another task so now to complete this task you need additional tokens so you need to buy some uh, mover and remover uh, uh, tools so you can go to hazel and see now i have only four berry tokens uh, if you want to buy them you need to buy this mover which cost you 10 tokens and remover which cost you another 10 tokens so total 20 tokens are needed so i'll go back to the farmland and i'll do some farming and go back to the uh, this i'll come back to hazel and i'll sell my berry tokens so that i'll make some uh, 20 berry tokens so now I have sufficient tokens, click on buy tab, select mover, buy it, select remover, buy it. And now you have click on my land and go to visit your land. And now select this tool. So adjust the back again, move this mover and remover to the top column. And now you can just uh, click on mover, select any of this decorative item and move it a little. Then click on remover and click on any item that item will be removed. So now we have completed the quest. So now we just need to go back to the uh, post office and talk to her to finish the quest. So just come to the bottom enter the post office talk to the lady and there you complete the both the quest which belongs to the land so now you can see all my quests have completed and now that's all that that's a basic idea so now over that if you want to manage the energy so now you can see this energy bar right now the energy bar total will be thousand points and uh, to manage this there are so many things this grows very slowly so i'll explain you how you can manage this this is a graph from the community so for planting a seed you need two energy to water them you need 0.5 energy for harvesting you'll need one energy which means if you plant a pawberry and harvest to complete process you need 3.5 energy so that is what it costs and if you eat one pawberry you'll get only 0.35 energy so which is very less so now only way you can get the energy is by eating these fruits or any other stuff or if you are idle every two minutes you will receive 0.67 energy which means in a day i'll show you how much so 24 hours into 60 minutes so in a day we have this many minutes divided by 2 means you have 720 refills in a day if you are idle if you multiply with 0.67 which means every day you will be making around 482 energy in your energy bar if you are idle so now to increase this there is a technique i'll tell you that now so what you can do is uh, just go to the home page in the oh, click on home just walk towards north just beside this town hall you will see a path so just enter that path towards the right and now keep walking you will find a statue just cross that uh, statue and keep walking on this path just cross this road and now you can see one hut here so you just need to enter this building so here basically there is a pool if you enter this pool you will and ener your energy will be regained very fastly so if you go and talk to uh, Luke he will explain you how the pool works so if you are staying more than one hour it, he, they will kick you out so you cannot stay beyond one hour so every day you can sit in this pool for one hour and here you can see now I have 929 points of energy so after two minutes this will be increased by three points so which is very high compared to a normal idle situation so now you can see i got 32 932 energy which means every two minutes you will get three energy instead of 0.6 energy if you are idle so every day you can go to this pool one hour you can sit in the pool you will regain your 25 percent of the energy you can do some farming and again you can repeat that or maybe you can continue with the daily energy so that's all guys and one more thing why i selected this 4081 farm is because if you go to the right side you will see this house inside the house you can prepare the recipes because they have the cooker on the left side you have this windmill which you can create the floor which is required for the recipes in the bottom you have this uh, fall so where you can uh, keep your hands and you can do uh, egg farming so that's all guys that's all about today's video how you can do the farming how you can level up how you can increase your uh, energy faster so if you like this video click the like button if you're new to this channel subscribe to this channel if you have any doubts or clarification leave them in the comment below so that's all guys thanks for watching jai hind